Guess what? It's true. All of it. It's all real. God is real. The angels are real. Miracles happen every day, happen all the time. How do I know? My Baba, my dog. I know he was delivered by angels. So when I look at him, I know. When I see his influence in my life and my decisions, I know. It's not just stuff that I came about or just made up my mind about. No, no, I've seen the proof. I've seen the miracles. I've seen the synchronicities. I've seen the messages. The messages seem seem to always convey this the 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 the, the one thing. Be happy. Don't worry. We got it. It's so funny because this remind me it reminds me of again the, the relationship that I have with Baba. It's 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 amazing because he's a lot like me too and he can get obsessive and when we're walking you know other dogs will be barking at him you know and other dogs can you know out of their windows or their yards or their fences you know they're barking and he starts whining he feels bad you know and he's like i'm sorry baby i'm sorry let it go though let it go you know haters are gonna hate that's what they do okay they don't know that you're a friendly guy and that you want to make friends, but they wouldn't, basically they wouldn't know a good thing when they see it, you know, and that's how a lot of people behave, you know, and uh, it's crushing for those who want to make a connection because, you know, you realize, oh, people are just mean. It's like, well, yeah, there are some people who are just, are so mean that, that they think that's normal. <laughs> basically, that's what I'm trying to get at. And then there are also, also those occasions where, for instance, you know, when fireworks are going off, you know, uh, he would be so scared because fireworks scared, scared dogs in a great way. I mean, a horrible way, too, because he will be sitting in the corner just shaking and he will be doing it for hours. And regardless of what I tell him, I will hug him. I'll try to make him feel better. It's OK, baby. It's OK. Everything's going to be fine. I got you. And then I started thinking, this is exactly what God does for me. With all these symbols and signs and synchronicities that, that it sends, you know, to let me, let me know, it's okay, baby, I got you. But we'll, we'll still be sitting there, you know, shaking and doubting and fear. That's what I'm trying to get at. These, whatever happens in your life, forget about the surface level. There's something, there's a deeper message. And I think that's what we all miss. The fact that we live in paradise and we can make this into heaven or hell. Because hell and heaven are within you. I mean, think about it. When you're feeling badly, does that feel heavenly? Absolutely not. You're in hell. You're in the basement, like I call it. It's dark, it's desolate, there's no options, you know, you see nothing but basically no options. Or you can be in the penthouse, in the big open heavenly penthouse where you can see everything. Everything's better in the penthouse, you know. It's the stuff that you deserve. It's where God is. It's where love is. It's where freedom is. That's the basement feel like freedom absolutely not but joy does happiness fulfillment purpose I mean you ever done something that you're just so good at that <laughs> hours go by and you don't feel it you know it'd be three in the morning you're still working at it because you're having so much fun <laughs> that's what I'm referring at to is it's just that the divinity that we're full with that surrounds us but when we get stuck thinking or overthinking analyzing things then we separate ourselves from that 
eternal flow. So, what I'm saying here is that pay attention. All those signs are designed to uplift you, to make you feel happy and peaceful because God and the angels want you peaceful and happy. No, they don't want you to be just smiling idiots, but no. Is that at that point you'll be residing with God itself in heaven because it will feel heavenly. That's what I'm trying to get at. That the other way that was prescribed for you is hellish. That's hell, right? So that you must climb, you must rise yourself to that point. I mean, it would be nice, right, if the angels could rescue you from the depths, and they do, you know, because they get you to the next step, so you can take the next step, and you build momentum, and as they say, you know, God helps those who help themselves, you know. <laughs> it's, it's that idea, because you have to choose it, you see? Heaven or hell, penthouse or, 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 or the basement. But the reason why I brought it up is because all of that is keeping you happy is so you're open to the information that that they're trying to reveal to you that you know of your true identity basically that you're just an angel with amnesia that the world made you forget what your true mission was and ever since you landed here the God uh, God and the angels have been working day and night to let you know the the real truth so no 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 don't listen to them <laughs> just listen to your heart we're there if you ever want to visit me I'm in here if you ever want me to get you something as here, think about it, because as above, so below. If you've been living a life of miser misery, it's because of the thoughts you're entertaining. That's all. See, I told you you have to walk there, you have to climb there, you have to walk away from the basement. A lot of people will tell you that, oh, that's irresponsible, you're ignoring this, you're ignoring... Yes, ignore it. Ignore it. Because you're more powerful in heaven than you are in hell. In hell... Whoever invented hell is the only one benefiting from it. Not you. So remember, God is real. The angels are real. Miracles happen all the time. And you can only hear God in your heart and you can only visit God and ask him for what you want in your mind so now you know that God is real the angels are real and the miracles happen all the time